Welcome back everybody to another episode today of the Pokemon Coliseum Randomizer. Today we're gonna be we're gonna be just just pushing through a big part of the story and we are going to have a little peekaboo, maybe a little bit more, at the under. As uh, as a follow-up of that. Oh my goodness, I hope I don't, don't get lost. <laughs> I looked at some video of it. Uh, not some video. I didn't look at video. I looked at a, a text guide for the under. Because I, I actually don't want to be surprised. Uh, I do want to be surprised. I don't want it to be spoiled for me. Because I actually remember, I didn't get further than Mount Battle. I didn't get further than Mount Battle. So I'm very curious what the under actually is. I'm, I'm assuming it's under something. Because it's the under. But uh, fr from what I've seen, it's like... Make five lefts, go up a stairway, go down a stairway, go, you know, do the hokey pokey. I don't know. It's, it's just kind of all over the place. So, I have some notes. I hope, I hope I, I know what I'm doing. I mean, uh, I don't know if I'm supposed to tell you that, guys, but, uh, but, but I, I don't want to be running around in circles. So, so with that being said, I did mount battle off screen. Uh, well, not off screen, I do have a recording of it, and it will be at the end of this episode right here. You guys will see a little montage of that, and in addition to that, I went to Pyrite Coliseum, did some battles there, and the team is pretty pimped out. You can see all the levels here. We are pimped out. We have these two bad boys are purified. We have some new moves. And also with that, I got some new TMs. And the most notable is the one that I actually taught. And it was Brick Break. Our for Alligator has Brick Break. And it's pretty freaking amazing. That thing has really high attack. And fighting types are physical here. So very, very happy about that. And we're gonna we're just gonna leave with the aces here. This is an admin battle. That's why I didn't do it off screen or you know grinding, whatever you want to call it. So yeah, this is an admin battle against Dakim. And with that, I'm gonna stop just bullshitting here and we're actually gonna get something done. We're actually gonna get something done here. We got Dakim, yeah boy. Fine. I'm Lower my mic a little bit here. There we go. Fine. After all the persuading I did, you still won't hand it over. Ooh, he's denying him. Hmm. This is what happens to stubborn oafs who don't do as I say. He just he just pushed him over. He literally just pushed him over. Just, ouch, that probably hurt. That looks like a metal sort of a base. Or at least concrete. Ouch. That hurts, dude. Wow, okay. You treacherous swine! How, how could you refuse to battle? <laughs> Wow, this guy has the crazy hair too. What the hell is going on here? Ah, treacherous! You didn't really think that a worm like you could whip. He literally pushed him down, and he looks like a worm right now. That's terrible. All you had to do was hand over the time flute without making a fuss. It's your own fault for getting hurt. Since you're not cooperating, I don't have any choice but to haul you off to Ian's lab. Yo, my guy. What? This guy is freaking tattoo. Oh, I skipped this thing. Uh, he has like, uh, like those look like the, the, the some color sort of a mutation of like the curly bracket on the keyboard. What on earth? And he, and he has like poke cubes on a necklace. You're a very confusing individual, Dakim. I'll tell you that much. That off of yours, you must be the troublemaker who messed with Scrub in Celebi's forest. And now you've come to mess with me, the great Dakim. Don't make me laugh. I want to beat this guy's ass right now. I'll pound a lesson into your flesh and bones so you'll never even think of bothering me again. That's like a real threat. He just did that. What a barbaric animal. Well, anyway, folks, I will say this. The grinding that I had to do here... The nine battles in a row, like the first three or four, all had legends. I think the first four in a row. One had Rayquaza, another had Regirock, another had Mewtwo, another had Celebi. No, someone had Celebi at some point. Did I say Rayquaza? Celebi? No, I don't know. You guys will see in the grinding layer. There were so many legends. I, I was about to like flip my shit. I was like, <coughs> terrible. So this guy has five Pokemon. He does have a Shadow Pokemon, I believe. I was supposed to stock up off-screen as well, but I didn't. We do have a lot more money now because of the Pirate Coliseum, though, so that'll be good. And with that, what do we want to do? We're going to go for a Brick Break, I think. That'd be, like, neutral against the Delibird. And we're going to go... Uh, I mean, Dragon Ranch has just been, honestly, quite swell for me, so I'm just going to keep that going. And we should have quite a few TMs. You're not the first Pokemon to have Wonder Guard. You are not the first Pokemon to have Wonder Guard. Here, which is actually fucking frustrating. Why I didn't use why didn't I use brick break on you? I totally just had a brain fart. Well, either way, I did a lot, so cool beans. But anyway, yeah. Wing attack. Woo! That stab crit though, okay. So yeah, it's uh 
not the first Pokemon to have that, uh, that ability. Either way, yeah, at the under, we should have, I was looking up TMs, a lot of TMs are purchasable at the under. So we got a lot of money from Pirate Coliseum, we're gonna get more money soon in just random battles and stuff, so hopefully by the time that we get to the under, which is pretty damn soon, then we will be able to just purchase a crap ton of TMs and teach some new moves, because some of our moves are questionable, I will say in the least. We have Snubble, oh, this is perfect! We just got Brick Break, this is, like, perfect. This is honestly awesome. This is honestly awesome, we got Sandstream Snubble, okay. Yeah, good thing we have Brick Break or else that would just be annoying that, that, that Stantler. Like, goddamn. Oh, wait, did I? Oh, this is, it's the second turn? I think I just totally derped. I think I'm just in kind of automatic mode. I've been playing this game for hours today, and I think I'm out of focus a little bit. <laughs> I was like, I I've been playing just grinding for hours, I just want to record. But I'm kind of in robot mode as a result of that, I feel like. So, it's okay though, it's okay. The team's getting really powerful, and it's, it'll be a good time, it'll be a good time. This is going to be one of the toughest battles that we have here, since it is a, uh, it's an admin battle. And honestly, it just depends on what the hell the game actually gives them, you know? Because that's just the way that it works. Either way, I'm going to double team this Lilith, because I have a feeling it's going to be a little bit of a troll, even though we do have Brick Break. I do feel like that's our only really viable move that we have right now, and uh, we'll make the most of it. We'll make the most of it. Like I said, I'm really excited, really looking forward to getting some TMs that we'll be able to purchase. That'll be a big win for us. That'll be really going in the right direction. So, either way, if you guys don't know, this series goes up three times a week. I've been very good about keeping with the schedule. A Shellgon. Ooh, that's interesting. That's actually going to be bulky. That's annoying. Oh, that's the Shadow Pokemon. Oi. Oi. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna try and catch that. I forgot to stock up on Pokeballs, but we could always go back and catch this thing if we want. That is going to be a late evolution, which I'm not a fan of, but Shellgon's still really powerful. And I might have a change of heart, because I just like Shellgon. And if this, thing has, if this thing has good moves especially, I'll be very much so inclined to do that. So, anyway. Anyway, what was I saying? Yes! Monday, Wednesday, Friday, this has been going up, so they're coming out rapid fire, and I apologize if you can't keep up with it, but hopefully you can binge watch it at some point and enjoy it, and all that kind of good stuff, because I've been having a good time with it. Coliseum is definitely a game that I haven't played in a while. Uh, I don't think I've ever played it in its full, because I always end up just getting some kind of roadblock. Last time I tried to do this on the channel, I ended up getting roadblocked because of a save issue, but, you know, I call, call uh, blah, blah. XD I've played quite a few times, but Coliseum not as much. Uh, yeah, so I want to get a read on this Shellgon. I'm honestly really curious. Damn, we just had our toxic Pokemon, uh, well, I know, I've, I've learned that you shouldn't toxic Pokemon that you want to catch, but, uh, yeah, okay, anyway. Uh, da 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 my, my content creator friends have not been afraid to bash me, like, Josh, what the hell's wrong with you? Uh, yeah, let's just take out this, uh, actually, well, I'm just gonna go, like, fly, I'll go just for a super weak move, because I don't want to kill the Snubble, and then kill the Shellgon in an accident. Like, I really just want to get a gauge, like, on this thing's moveset, because I'm just curious. I'm really just curious right now. Just show me one of your moves. My man, just show me one of your moves. Show me your moves. Come on, girl. Come on, girl. Are we, are we talking good stuff here? No, Shadow Rush. Okay, so that doesn't help. If you guys remember, the Shadow Pokemon do show their other moves for whatever reason they do that, so that's kind of cool. All right, we're gonna... Well, actually, it's gonna get that, that chip damage as well. I'm gonna go another... Actually, Fly's gonna do a little bit more now that we have less HP. Huh, do we have a, just a bullshit move? We probably do. This thing probably doesn't have an easy catch rate, though, so we're gonna have to do more damage to it, that's for sure. Let's go Wing Attack. I feel like that's gonna do nothing, and like I said, guys, worst-case scenario... Flatter, that probably won't... I don't think that attacks at all or does anything. What does that do? <laughs> probably should know that <laughs> but yeah we are oh, special attack rules but you're confused oh fuck I know what flatter does I should know the moves that I'm using people are ripping up the hair right now aren't they and no fear we can go back supposedly good it attacked I actually want that don't I I'm curious what your other moves are come on now come on now. That, that's what I've never heard of like flatter so uh, so you, you learn you live you learn and you make mistakes but you learn so there you go Venusaur yes my guy oh man between the the shadow rush and the sandstorm and just the confusion I mean not not very encouraging but this thing I'm not sure if it inherits the catch rate of the original Entei because this wasn't Entei here so we got to be careful with that but 
Either way, uh, let's just... Let me use this turn to toss a nice, big, fat meatball at our buddy here. And what are we going to do with you? We're going to sharpen. We're going we're gonna to sharpen up our skills here with the Venusaur. Very nice. Come on, just just catch it. I hope it has the Shell Gun catch right. Either way, they're both pretty bad, but I would rather take Shell Gun, you know? Ooh. I'm surprised we even got two of it. Come on now. Ah. I'm looking up its catch rate because I'm not sure if it inherits its own catch rate or the other catch rate. Look at this guy coming through with the actual attacking. Shellgon, you have a catch rate of 5.9%. So 6%, that's not bad. That's not bad at all. We could do that. Now the question is, is that the catch rate that it actually has or does it just keep the shitty, shitty catch rate that is Entei? Because if it does, then, then we're fucked pretty much. That's what that comes down to. I don't know. We'll, we'll give it a few more tries. Honestly, though, I'm really happy with the team to a point where I, I'm just... I'm not going to bend over backwards for this. I spent a lot of time today grinding up the team to a point where I feel a little bit more comfortable with it. So we'll, we're going to give this one or two more tries, I would say. And then we're just going to kind of abandon it and uh, carry on with our own little shenanigans, whatever we're trying to do here. Okay, this thing's not getting caught. I'm giving this thing one more try. Like I said, I'm super happy with the team. I know it's it's good to catch as many as you can, and they could have different moves and all this other stuff. But uh, you know, you know, I I I I I, I we will have TMs coming up, so that's also a thing. Why is this a thing right now? Hold on, give me a second, guys. The grun grun. Whoa, whoa! Look at me, I'm transparent. Wow, that's crazy. So I'm trying to adjust my my green screen. What the hell is going on? What the hell is going on? Okay. There we go. Sorry for any green screen malfunctions. Yikes. Okay, we're good. Sorry about that, guys. That's one thing about green screen. Sometimes sometimes you gotta do a live edit. Uh, sorry if that annoyed anybody. But, but now it's, now it's too late to realize because it's not happening anymore. Yay. Uh, you're not getting caught. You're not getting caught. I'm gonna give you one more great ball. And then I'm just kind of not gonna try. Did I use a great ball with both of you? Okay, no, there we go. Uh, you gotta fight for your right. I just realized we could have called before. We could have called instead of flattering it. <sighs> instead of doing that stupid ballsy thing. Why do you tempt me so much? Ugh, you piece of garbage. Ugh. Just hurt yourself. Gah. Fucking shit, man. All right. We're giving this one more try. I think that's the that's all we're going to have left cuz if, even if you use shadow rush, it's just going to kill itself with the recoil. Especially after this. Uh, after this this sandstorm. There we go. So this is the best chance that we have at it, folks. This is the best chance. Even if it got to this point, it would, it would end up killing itself with the Shadow Rush anyway, so... We're going in. We're going one more Great Ball. And that's the best that we can do. I'm not going to bend over backwards anymore here. I mean, not that we really can, because this is going to die anyway. So we, we, we took this as far as we could. I mean, yeah, it was stupid to use Flatter, but it would get to this point anyway. Between the, the Shadow Rush recoil and, and all that kind of stuff. Alright. Can we get it? though? Nope! Fuck you! Piece of shit! Only one shake! You are annoying. You are honestly really, really annoying. And you snapped out of confusion. Oh, it has pain split. Oh, 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 wow, okay. Wow, so I can try and catch it. But you know what, man? You know what? I'm not gonna sit here for 20 minutes and and just uh, dilly-dally. We're gonna kill it. We're gonna kill it. I was about to say, we're gonna run. We can't run! This is an admin battle. We still need to, like, defeat it still or whatever. Luckily, it's almost dead anyway, so that's okay. And after this, I believe we're going to go to Pyrite, and we're going to do the Hokey Pokey, a.k.a. make 10 lefts and, you know, the whole sh shebang, and I did not mean to use Sharpen, but I digress. I digress. Hey, guys, let me know in the comment section if you're on summer break or not. I'm curious. I'm curious. Let me know if you're done testing and all that kind of good stuff. I know a lot of you watching probably in high school or younger or maybe a little bit older. Maybe you're in college. If you're if you're in college, then probably odds are you're already on summer. But I know I know 
my high school that I went to, you know, they, they're they just done, they're finishing classes now and they're doing testing for like a few weeks, which is not nearly as much time. So I'm curious from you guys, are you still testing? Have you been on summer break? What's your schedule looking like? How's it going? You know, let me know in the comments below. I would love to hear. Love to hear about you guys. Anyway, Dakim says, The way you handle those Pokemon with your aud audacious, audacious skill. Who are you? I'm, I'm Josh. My man, that's Elliot the dumb bitch. There you go. We got the peons. Uh, oh, it's the scrub. Master Dakim. Uh, scrub. That was gross. Excuse me. Oh, yeah, you were hopelessly outclassed against him. You had zero chance of winning. I'm pulling out for now. You go to Ian's lab and help out there. As you wish, sir. Oh, snap. What is that thing he has in the front? What the hell? It's like he's wearing, like, a backwards cape, but, like, lower than it should be. I don't know. That's just weird. That's just weird, my man. Like, what the hell is this? I don't know. This isn't over yet. Stronger Pokemon are being made even now. You'd better get serious about training your Pokemon for our next meeting. Ha! You are quick. What did he just do? He literally just, like... He, he, like, bounced backwards? What? What? That, that, okay, you know what? You know what? You know what? What do we have here? The F disc. The fuck disc. That is where he keeps his porn. Yo, Dak, you forgot your porn. You jumped out of here so fast, you left your porn behind. God. What's up? Is this, is this, like, the old leader for this area? Ow, that was an experience, was an experience I want to ever, ever want to have again. I'm glad you came to my rescue. Thank you. I'm Vander. Yo, Vander! I think I discovered that last episode. I'm Vander. Vander Forge. Uh, I'm an area leader here at Mount Battle. Good ship. I'm Elliot, and this is Josh. We're glad to see you. Elliot explained everything that happened to Vander. That is such a great cop-out, but it's good. That's the type of stuff we need in, like, Ultra Sun and Moon. Like, oh, blah, 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 blah. Like, I mean, it's, is it cheap? Yeah, but do we like it? Yeah, I don't want to hear the whole nine yards again. I'm cool with that. That's what I'm saying. Hmm, what you've told me explains a lot. <laughs> that is a cop-out, but I like it. Thanks to you, I know exactly why they attacked us. This is the Time Flute. I happened to find it while I was on my training trek. It said the Time Flute will summon Celebi, but just once. There must be something about Celebi that frightens them. They obviously don't want Celebi to encounter Shadow Pokemon, but let's not spend any more time here. Let's go back! Okie dokie. I got the itches. I got the itchy, itchy itches right now. What's good? But here, I want you to have this. The Time Flute! Hey, hey, hey! But, but, are you certain? May we really have something as precious? Oh, yes we can. Of course you may! Ha <laughs> ha. Great minds think of light, Vander. Ha <laughs> ha. I'd rather you ha- I'd rather have you use that time flute than have those crooks take it by force. Use it and save the Shadow Pokemon from their sinister plans. Okie dokie, what's over here? Some- some goodies? TM47. I was looking for TMs! Oh my god, this is a good TM. I swear, I- I will like, flip a table over. Oi. Uh, oh, stealing! That's actually a good TM! <gasps> Come on! That's not fair. I was looking for TMs. Ah, uh, that's actually a good one. Yeah, I was gonna say Zapdos can get that. Some steel type coverage. I mean, not the best type of coverage in the world, but like, cool still. Oh, it was actually tough. So this is a physical move, and Zapdos, I believe, is more of a special attacker. But we're gonna see what its physical attack is. We're gonna see if it's worthwhile. Uh, yeah, no, special attack is way better. I'm gonna take that over the arm thrust, just because that is... We do have fighting type coverage already, so I'm okay with getting rid of that. So we'll get rid of it. With that, we're gonna head back to Pyrate, and I'm gonna be very, uh, you know... Noobishly, totally not following a post-it note with what to do. Because honestly, right now, just imagine, if, if you're in my position, I, I would not know where to go, because I'm stupid. So I would be like, okay... What the hell do we do now? Do we, like, do we go through the rest of Mount Battle? Because that's what I would do. <laughs> I would be a stupid ass and do that. I don't know. So, we're going to do some shenanigans, and we're going to be heading to the under soon. And, uh, sh I mean, I, I hope I hope it doesn't disappoint, man. I hope it doesn't disappoint. And, uh, for now, I believe we need to get some sort of a jail key and something along those lines. Hello, 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 wow. Oh, 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 I'm sorry, Chief, but there's big news. You see, Chief, there's talk that there's a mysterious syndicate poised to take over the world. Huh? Chief, you're not the Chief. I beg your pardon. I'm here, Johnson. That story isn't new. Why are 
all your reposts, reports, reposts. Why are all your reports so out of date all the time? Oh, oh, chief, there you are. You're such a kidder. <laughs> okay, totally not looking down. What do we do here? So, so we're gonna we're gonna chill over here. What's good? Oh, ha, ha. look at that. That's the jail key. Can I take a minute? How how would I know to do any of this without looking at a guide? Like I, I'm posing this question to like the developers of this game. Like just just. Just, just why? Like, how would I know to go to this building again? So relevant. Like, it's relevant, but like, is it though? And, and then go to this table and pick up the sparkling ob object that happens to be a jail key. Like, 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 what? What does that have to do with anything? You might as well just tell me to go to the upper right hand corner of the town and find a dumpster truck of, like, gerbils. What? That, that, that's like, that's so out of nowhere. But okay, I digress. I digress. Now, this is a story all about how I don't know what the fuck to do with my life. I don't even know. So now, are we gonna run into a friend here? Are we gonna, are we, are we gonna run into this little, little, little buddy here? Oh, that's cool. I don't know if we have to do that, but but that's cool. We have to talk to duking now. Take a big fat duke. I don't know. I don't know where he is, but I'm just gonna assume it's. Was he in the hotel? No. 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 He wasn't. Don't trick me. If he is, then I'll be annoyed because I just walked past it. You're over here, right? The duke man. Duke man. Duke man. Duke man. Nope. You ain't. Where's that child labor force thing? Come on now. I know you have your child labor force. Don't hide it from me. Is it the hotel? No, it can't be. Nope. Elliot, you get in the way so much, I don't know what to tell you. Aha, yes. This is where the Duke man is. Hello, Duking. What's up? We're going to check in with Duking now. Josh, I heard. Thank you. You did it again. But we don't know why they would go after Mount Battle. I'll explain what happened to Duking. Ha, 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 ha. Ah, so that's why. <laughs> this just feels like, I feel like they rushed through this for something. I, I don't know, like... I'm like, I'm like crossing myself because I said that would be good for Ultra Sun, but I don't know. So that's why they're after the Time Flute. That's what it was. Still, the Relic in a Gate seems to be important to Shadow Pokemon. I think you should check into the Relic some more. Well, okie doke then. Um, what was I going to say? By the way, yes, I checked the PC, that, that Plusle. I forgot to mention this at the beginning of the episode. The Plusle is randomized, but it's level 13 and it's a Silcoon. So, no thank you. No thank you. It also, one of its only moves is, uh, I think, Fissure, and that won't work until you're higher level, and it's level 13, so that's, like, useless for a long time. So, yeah, pretty much that's that. Alright, so now I believe we are going to pop over to... Um... Uh... uh We're gonna go to... Fuck it, let's go to a gate and see what happens. We're supposed to investigate the Relic Stone more, so why not go to the town of the Relic Stone? Yeah. Oh, hello there! Hi! Oh, Elliot, I heard there was a big commotion on Mount Battle. This was not in the guy. That's a load of bullshit. I didn't know. Ah. Yeah. Oh, Elliot, I heard there was a big commotion. Yeah, I just said that. Egan's worried. Sick about you. Quick, hurry home and reassure him that you're safe and sound. Okay, I'm, I'm just going to write a separate post to know that this is not in the guide. Maybe I can inform someone about that. Maybe that would be useful. Just, just, just to polish it. Go back to a gate after. We're making the world a better place, ladies and gentlemen. Unless I just overread it and was being even more stupid. Okay, so we're going to go home here. We're going we're gonna to see what is popping. See if we got some food or something yummy over here. I don't know. Could go for some food in-game. We haven't ate in uh, probably like weeks but that's okay no 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 oh, what is up here is there anything good here what's going on oh look at this look at this nice little nice little torchic poster look at that or uh, picture whatever it is there's a bed we like to take i mean i mean i'm, 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 
I'm not gonna say no to a nice nap. I mean, who doesn't like a nice nap? I'm sure we have some people that are watching that like a good nap. If you like a good nap, let me know in the comment section below. I like naps. Naps are good. Get a little refresher. Some people don't. I do. Ah, Elliot and Josh, it's so good to see you back. So, how goes it? Have you trounced the, the cretins, the cretins that raided Mount Battle? Oh, hell yes. Oh, hell yes. You know we did. I expect nothing less of my own granddaughter. And, of course, Josh, you didn't do anything. Elliot didn't do shit. Elliot is a useless piece of garbage. That is confirmed. I can confirm that to you right now. <clears throat> I see. So, Vander conferred you, conferred the time flute upon you. Then, what are you waiting for? Depart for the Relic Forest and summon Selby at once. I wonder what will happen. I find it quite interesting. It's exciting. Interesting. Same thing. Ah, yes, there's something I'd forgotten. Josh, may I have... Uh, this was all missing. This was literally all missing. I, 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 I don't... I, you, you're fucking stupid. This guy's fucking stupid. This game is... good. I'm stupid. <laughs> but it's okay. We're gonna go down to the Relic Stone. We're gonna see what's popping. We're gonna test out that time flute, though. Eh, it's gonna be a good time. We're gonna see Selby. Maybe it'll be shiny. Do some soft resets right now. That'll be that'll be pretty cool. Pretty cool. All right, time flute time, motherfucker. We were just here. Look at this. Beautiful. I mean, we can't really use it because all our Pokemon are purified, but that's okay. That's okay. All right. It is. Okay, let's actually use the relic. The, 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 the time flute. Hello? Hello? That's just an item? A flute that literally summons Celebi as an item, not a kid? I'll tell you what, the Azure flute that summons God, you know, Arceus, that's a key item. I think Celebi is pretty damn important to, you know, justify a key item, but that's okay. Marvelous. Okay, so I guess you don't have to do that. I guess you don't have to summon Celebi, because we don't have a... Unless we have to literally go, like, right next to it. I'm just going to do that, because I don't want to have to run back again. Because we don't have anything that really can... It's meaningless to use that item. Oh, wait, did we just get a different message a minute ago? Interesting. So, it's meaningless when you use it right next to it, because that means, like, you don't have any Shadow Pokemon, you fuckface, you know? The idea is, if you just caught the Entei, you can just use the Time Flute, and then you don't have to, like, get the Heart Gauge down at all. It's just purified immediately. So that's kind of the novelty to that. But it looks like we don't need to do that to progress in the story. It's just kind of like, oh my god, that's so cool, you should, like, use it, my dude. 